Hello, and welcome to the Daily Almanac for February 24th. So, let's get started. First day in history! <laughs> On this day in history, February 24th in 1582, the Gregorian calendar was introduced in Rome. This was a calendar that solved the problems of earlier calendars, which had trouble keeping the same days in the same places year after year. Today, more than 400 years later, almost everyone in the world still uses it. Do you know why it's called a Gregorian calendar? It's named after Pope Gregory XII, who proclaimed it as the official calendar. On this day in 1861, something happened that would allow people to communicate across the entire continent in a matter of moments. The Western Union Telegraph Company completed a telegraph line between Washington, D.C. and San Francisco. The Chief Justice of California sent the first transcontinental telegram to Abraham Lincoln, predicting that the new link would help ensure the loyalty of the Western states to the Union during the Civil War. Finally, on this day in 1848, Gold was discovered at a remote California trading post named Sutter's Mill. This touched off the California Gold Rush. World Power! Today on Word Power, we're going to talk about the word astronaut. An astronaut is someone who goes through training in order to learn how to travel in outer space. The word astronaut combines the Latin word for star, astron, and for sailor, nautes. Hey, would you like to go sailing in the stars someday? I would. <laughs> Today on Extremes, we ask, how far can an egg be dropped without being broken? The farthest successful egg drop was 700 feet, or 213 meters. In August of 1994, an egg was dropped from a helicopter flying above onto a golf course in Blackpool, Lancashire in the United Kingdom. The man who conducted the experiment explained that the only way to have a successful drop is to make sure that the egg is moving forward as fast as it's dropping and that it lands on a steep slope. Health tips. <laughs> when you sneeze, you may say achoo with your mouth, but the main job of a sneeze is to clear things out of your nasal passages. Sneezes are good for you, so it's not a good idea to try to stop them. Also, be sure to cover your mouth when you sneeze so the germs you expel don't get a chance to circulate and be picked up by someone else. I do you have clothes and toys that you don't use anymore? Maybe you have a younger sibling or cousin who could use them. It seems like a much better idea to give away your old things than to just throw them out. If you don't have anyone to give your old clothes and toys to, you could have a garage sale. That way you can make a few extra pennies for your piggy bank and recycle your things too. Well, that's all the time we have left today for Daily Almanac. Thanks for stopping by, and I hope to see you tomorrow. <laughs>